How y'all doing? Uh, as you see by the title and thumbnail of today's video, we're doing a will it run. Uh, it's December 5th, my birthday. It's a brisk, probably, oh, it's probably negative 15. We got light dusting of snow last night. It's probably, give or take, 2 o'clock. Um, thought what better time than to, you know, mess around with some small some junk and, and, uh, throw a video up for you guys so I got this blower here the engine came to me in two boxes I cobbled one engine out of two took the better frame mounted it on and here we are doing a wheel it run got a little bit of fuel I, I'm like starting out at, at, at base at baseline right I'm not knowing What, uh, let me see if you guys can see that. Got a, got, this is a second video with my Canon camera here and, and, uh, seems to be holding up. Battery life is amazing on it. It, it works good in the cold. Um, you know, see how it works this summer. See if, if it'll work. We always go get some more gas, but uh, we'll see. If it's got gas, I have to hook the fuel line up, and then uh, I'll just run it, you know, kind of through the shroud. Kind of half ass. Well, for shits and giggles, we'll see. Uh, see what's going on here. See if she'll uh, pop off. Uh, might not have spark. I don't know if I got much gas down that cylinder there, but should have a little bit. I had it smoking um, here before. I had the camera on. It's smoking pretty good. spot for that uh, re the, the recoil. I might have to turn it the other way so I can pull that way. I'm going to grab a tiny bit of gas out of the screw here. Okay, so we're back. Obviously, just cut right. I did. I'll, I'll just edit that out. Um, got a bit more gas this time. Might try a different plug. We'll go searching for a plug here in a minute. I got a little in there now. This one was a electric start, but the starter is 
stripped. Um, it's, it's screwed. The teeth are chewed off the flywheel. It's an old beater engine. If we don't get it running, we're either going to see why it failed or if it'll run. Um, if we don't get this one running, I have another one that I can drop on here. And we'll try this will it run again. But I'm, I'm fairly certain that I can get this one running. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to try a different plug. Take you guys with me and see what I got. Got for some spark plugs here. It's uh, really chilly. Um, oh man, it's so, why is it so warm in here? I don't even have the heat on. And it happened yesterday too. I got it all blocked in, and maybe just from the sun, it, it warmed it up that much. So there is a spark plug in this old head here. I'm going to make sure I got the right size uh, spark plug wrench. Grab a spark plug wrench. What do we got? That one should do it. Not quite. Did we just have this one? See now I can cheat and I'll have to set you guys right, right here so that you can see our spark plug. And I can just grab a vice grip. Then I gotta clean this table off. Then we're doing another will it run on a weed whacker. Uh, and then we'll do another will it run on a skidoo eventually. And will it runs are gonna start coming from here on out. Sorry that my hand's in the way, but come on. I might tap this with a hammer quickly. And I know you guys can't see much. I don't have my small stand. It broke. So I got one on order. It's just got to come. Okay. Make sure you guys can see that, okay? It broke. There we go. <laughs> zoom all the way out. Yeah. That plug, still not focusing, but there we go. That plug is it's a little on the gross side, but it's better than, you know, I think another reason to, you know, um, I might have to, um, depending on how long this gets, I might have to do a part two and adjust that coil so that it sparks some more but we'll try this different plug because I, I don't know if it's it's going in this boot high enough yeah inside that boot there's a little um thingy that needs to be cleaned up you know it'll be hard for you guys to see but you just gotta trust me on that hoping if if not I can Set you guys back up and I'm going to scratch, scratch the inside of that spark plug cable there because it's all rusty. Like literally everything on this entire build. Okay. It's cold, man.
it's on. I'll try it. If not, we'll take it back in the, in the bus and really, really go at it here. See, see what we shouldn't be on wide open here. Should be closed. And then I'll just have to adjust the throttle from here. I want to try and scratch this cable up some more. I'm pulling it around is what I'm doing. Don't recommend doing this, but I gotta get in there, so. on to dribble a hair more gas down I'll be able to just go down the carburetor Shoot it in there. Choke on. Try the primer. I know I need to adjust that coil. So this will be part one and it's starting to snow and negative 15 and it's my birthday. But uh, part one. Adjust that coil up a little higher. Make sure we're getting good spark. Then it'll run. Okay. If you like what you see here. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And again, I'm Cavus. I run Recoil Small Engine as a YouTube channel, as you see, but also as a company. Um, so, like what you see here, consider hitting that subscribe button. It, it, it helps me out a lot. Um, more and more and more of you are starting to find me, which is pretty cool. Um, well, I'll quit rambling on. This is going to be edited on my computer. I'm learning the whole new YouTuber. Uh, you know, I bought a $600 camera. Um, you know. So, anyhow, catch you guys next time.